Testing, testing, one, two, three. Can you read me loud and clear? If so, greetings and many great hellos. This is Cottonmouth255, the Spore Serpent, and I am here for another video test of the Monster Hunter Try Ultimate demo. Now, uh, what I'm testing is, first of all, the recording equipment itself, as with the other two. But I'm also testing how well I can record with my 3DS XL actually hooked up to the camera, uh, how well my headset works, and how well my commentary itself will work. So, without further ado, let us begin. So we're just going to do something short and sweet here. We're going to be hunting the Lagombi. Um, the equipment I'm going to be using is the Switch Axe. Uh, it's one of my favorite weapons to be honest. So here we go. Let's get Cha-Cha and Kayamba and depart on quest. Now, if this is your first time playing Monster Hunter, I'm going to try to walk you through this. So, you have 20 minutes to go. In the supply box here, we have first aid medications, rations, cleansers, sonic bombs, a shock trap, barrel bomb, a health horn, a barbecue spit, raw meat, pickaxes, bug nets, and worms. So we're just going to be taking those items. Uh, so, rations here restore your stamina, like so. Okay, now I'm going to be showing you how the bug net works in area one. So, over here, you can see like a butterfly flying around. And this allows us to use the bug net. Like so. Now onward to area two. There he is. Okay, Lagombi. This monster, in my opinion, is quite fun to fight. As you can see, he's got several different attacks, most of which involve sliding on the ice, like so. And he can also throw ice and other projectiles. That I consider to be his most powerful attack, although I'm not quite sure. His most unpredictable attack is the one he's doing there. And it's quite hard to keep up with him most of the time. Honestly, seriously, what are you doing? Keep up with me. Ah, Snowball. So if you become trapped like this, you want to use a cleanser, and that'll get all the snow off of you. Okay. Whoa. That was a close one, and what do you know? We managed to break his ears. So we're gonna grab this. He dropped that. And it's a beast here, and... Ah. Oh, thought I could dodge that. Okay. We're in a bit of a tough situation here. So we're going to be using the first aid meds. 
to restore our health. And here we keep fighting. Awesome. That hopefully did a lot of damage. I love using the switch axe so much just for that attack. So I'm not going to be doing a lot of explaining about Lagombai because I'm thinking of doing that once I actually do a playthrough of the game. So I'm just going to be killing him, testing out the audio, that kind of stuff. And this is really loud. I can barely hear myself talk. So when he does that, that ice chunk throw, he will sometimes throw two ice chunks. <sighs> Wrong button. So as I'm demonstrating, the switch axe can be turned from an axe into a sword. Thank you, Cha-Cha. So as you see in the upper left corner of the screen, the icon, the sword icon there, has changed from blue to green. And that means the sharpness of my weapon has gone down. Normally, that's always a bad thing, but in this case, it doesn't matter. Ha, I got you in the face there, like gone by. And off he goes to area four. So we're gonna heal up and then sharpen our weapon with a whetstone. See, now we're back to blue. Uh, first aid medications. Oh, stamina just went down, so I'm going to take another ration. There you are, buddy. Okay, that was unexpected. So, as you can see, I have acquired Ice Blight, and the only way to cure that is to use a Nullberry, like I just used. Oh, that was totally unexpected. Die, die, die. So, the most often method you want to use is sword mode, because it's a lot more powerful. And what do you know, he's already limping away. Limp, limp, limp. As I was saying, you want to use sword mode as often as you can. You want to use sword mode as often as you can, because it's more powerful. And it's faster. Now I'm just going to show off the pickaxe. If you go up to oddly colored rocks like this, you can mine. Like so. And you can keep doing so until your pickaxes all break. So off to area 7, following... Oh, there he is! Come on. There, he's getting enraged. Aha! Let's finish you. Perfect. 
Well, farewell and many great goodbyes. This has been Cottonmouth255, the Spore Serpent, and I will see you next time for the first recording of my official Monster Hunter Tri-Ultimate playthrough.